okay now move on to the next program multiplexer using multiplexer you can realize for any boolean expression so as per the question given a four variable logic expression simplify it using appropriate technique and realize the simplified logic expression using 8 is to 1 multiplexer ic and implement the same in hdl that is using xilinx program for this you have to know about what is multiplexer multiplexer means many to one a multiplexer is a circuit with many inputs but have only one output the circuit has n input and m control signal and one output signal for the exam you will get any boolean expression for f of a comma b comma c comma d as a four variable as per the question this is you will get sop equation sigma of m 0 1 4 5 8 okay this equation for simplified into 8 is to 1 multiplexer there are three methods you go one for implementation table the second for your truth table reduction third for boolean expression reduction see we write for the boolean expression whatever the question number you have given zero you write the equivalent term a bar b bar c bar d bar 1 is a bar b bar c d 4 is 0 1 0 0 5 0 1 0 1 8 1 0 0 and 11 1 0 1 after the expansion of the sop form then you can take a common factor as d because i am expressing one of the output by using the variable as d then from this equation i am fixing as a d as a variable i am expressing output in terms of d after the take the common factor i got this equ equation y is equal to a bar b bar c bar dot 1 because d plus d bar is 1 then a bar b c bar is 1 and this there is no common factor i kept as it is by using separator with a dot d bar and third one is dot d see this is a bar b bar c can be represented as 0 for the 0 input that output should be what 1 and this is for the 0 1 0 that is for 2 that 2 is that output is for 1 and 1 0 0 1 0 0 is 4 the 4 is represented as d bar 1 0 1 is 5 the 5 is represented as d see whatever the number is not there here 0 is there 1 is not there 3 is not there 6 is not there 7 is not there for these things then then output should be what zero the remaining thing that output should be what 1 1 d bar d the same thing i can also do it by using a truth table reduction also see i am taking the same example i am writing the four variable expression whatever the value should be given from the corresponding line i put one and this can be reduction by using three variable a b c i fix then i i use the reduction method for truth table the common between 0 0 0 0 0 0 you can observe this the d is 0 output is 1 d is 1 output is 1 then it is not depend on the d value you can directly write d output should be was 1 the same method can be applied for all the variable you can check the last one 1 1 1 1 1 1 d is 0 1 the output should be always 0 then you can write only 0 then you got this answer that this is for second method then you can go for the last one is implementation table you can write the implementation table with row and column you can put the values in the implementation table what are the values is given in the question paper you circle it 0 1 4 5 8 11 as the implementation table shows both are circle then it is got 1 there is no circle the output should be 0 then both are circle 1 there is no circle 0 if only one is circle then it is called as d bar and here the corresponding row is d there is no circle i got 0 and this is called your input line d not d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 D7. This this will be connected to as your 8 is to 1 multiplexer. Take your 8 is to 1 multiplexer. The IC is 74151. It have a three select line. 9, 10, 11. It will be act as a select line A, B, C. Then you have a pin number 16 is VCC and pin number 8 as your ground. That pin number 7 and 8 will be connected to 
ground see connected pin number 7 and 8 is ground and you have to connect for the data lines from d0 to d8 according to the value calculated from the table you can connect it see in the table d0 should be 1 then d0 should be connected to vcc see this is your d0 pin number 4 is d0 connected to vcc line d1 should be 0 d2 is 1 vcc d3 is 0 d4 is d bar then this is take external one more d from the input line connected to the not gate output of not gate will be connected as a d bar then if you require d directly you can take the line d d6 is 0 d7 is 0 then all these value connected to ground if you design the circuit you can verify your truth table by using the pin number 5 let me go on to do it in the same uh, diagram in the trainer kit you can take the IC and for the IC is 74151 is a 16 pin IC and connected to the first slot. You can lock it. Then you can you require one more NOT gate also. You can connect for the NOT gate. Then you can take and wire through the basic connection of the NOT gate. Pin number 7 is the ground. Pin number 14 is your VCC, the NOT gate because you require D and you take any one pin as a D action input, they will connect it here. If you want D bar, you can take from the D bar here. Wherever you want, you connected this D bar, you keep left as it is. Then come to your multiplexer, the multiplexer is 60 pin IC. Then the 16 pin IC, you have a pin number 7 and 8 is ground as per the circuit. The pin number pin number 7 and 8 is ground then I short 7 and 8 you take a wire from 8 I connect it to the ground and the circuit you have a pin number 16 is VCC take the line from pin number 16 and uh, connect it to VCC then you can connect it for your uh, select line see in the circuit have a 9, 10, 11 is select line ABC you take 9 as A then 10 has B and 11 has C. Okay, don't confuse. This is your data input. D input. A, B, C. Now, A, B, C is over. Ground is over. 7 and 8 is over. You can take Y as your output line. Take pin number 5. Connect it to output line. If you don't want Y bar, you just leave that connection pin number 6. Then you connect as per your truth table, uh, you can connect to your input. See the pin number D0 is pin number 4. The pin number 4 is connected to VCC. Then pin number 4 is connected to VCC. And D1 is ground. The D1 is 3. Pin number 3 is connected to ground. Next, D2 is 1, D2 is pin number 2, it is connected to VCC. Next, uh, D3 is 0, connected to ground. Okay, now D4 is D bar. I already told if you want D bar, you take that uh, NOT gate output D4, connected to pin number 15. Pin number 15 is your uh, D4 and D5 is D. You can take the line from here or from the NOT gate. You take D that is connected to pin number 14. Pin number 14 is D5 and D6 is pin number 13 and pin number 12 you connected as a ground. You can short 13 and 12 and take the Y from any one of 13 or 12 connect 13. You connected 13 and 12 and connect it to ground see all the connection is over d0 d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 d7 as per the calculation of your implementation table now you can switch on your circuit switch on your circuit once you are switch on your circuit you can check your uh, output see all the values are 0 0 0 you can get it 0 0 0 Okay, you can check your truth table if it's 0 0 0 you can verify the output should be 0 then if you give 0 0 1 
as per the key 0 0 1 then output should be 0 the next is 0 1 0 the output is 1 next is 1 1 1 the output is 0 next is 4 1 0 0 d is a d bar see d is 0 the see if it is 1 0 0 then d it is called 1 0 0 the output should be d bar d is 1 you will get 0 d is 0 you will get 1 next 1 0 1 1 0 1 the output is same as d d value 0 the output is also 0 d value is 1 the output is also 1 ok now go for 1 1 6 1 1 0 that is output is always 0 1 1 1 then output is always 0 according to your true table ok this is verified your multiplexer program thank you